Hey folks, something different. This video I'm going to unbox a piece of audio. My Superlux E205U, which is the new mic for the studio for doing tutorials. So the idea is that I've got a large diaphragm condenser that's going directly into my screen capture software so that I can get better audio. Of course I have to speak better as well, but here's the unboxing of this, which I was actually really surprised by as I opened it. So here's my reaction as I'm opening it. So here's the unboxing of my new Superlux mic. Superlux are a cheap brand, but they're a good quality brand at the same time as well. This microphone does come as an E205 with a, an XLR on it, so you can use it as a studio recording mic. But this version is one with USB on it, so I can specifically use it with computers for doing the tutorial, so it's just easier. So now I'm gonna do a left-handed unboxing, or maybe not, maybe I'll swap around. Now I actually haven't opened this, so I have no idea what's in it yet. I know some people with unboxings have already done it, so we've got a USB cable. Oh, a substantial USB cable. That's good. A cute little stand, tiny little stand. I actually have a slightly larger stand than that that came with my old time microphone. So we have a cute pouch. Pouch is really, really nice, super looks. Oh, and it actually feels really, really heavy. Oh, yeah. So this is about the same size as the other studio condensers that I have floating around. It's nice weight in it. And of course the reason why I got it is because it has the volume knob on it. So that way I can actually turn it up and down from here. Because a lot of them go in as digital signals and you can't turn change the volume. And it'll go straight onto the stand I have in the studio. So I'm looking forward to giving that a try. And anything else in there? Nope, just a manual. I did also grab a couple of cheap Superlux headphones as well to go with them. So looking forward to giving that a try. The mic itself is, it, it is, it feels substantial. Oh, oh, that pushes in, that's nice as well. So you can see that pushes in and out. So you can't, it won't accidentally change it once it's on. So that's been the Superlux E205U. Something else I did notice after and that is that it has a headphone socket on the back so you can monitor what's going on as you're actually recording so you don't get any latency or delay uh, between what you're hearing and what's going down very handy <laughs>